Hey guys, welcome to ShiftCast. You're watching a segment from the full video. If you want to catch the full video, check it out in the live tab of our YouTube channel or on Spotify. Let's get right into it. It's the case of why they won't make land. Oh, not why they will. And I wasn't going to make you bet okay, against so your own your own ore. A mistake. I misread. Yeah, come on, dude. That actually would have been great content. So you yeah. yeah. So you want to take it? You want to take it anyway? We'll swap. Sure, I'll do it. Yeah, KC and oxygen. All right. Kate, jeez, that's brutal. <laughs> Casey and Oxygen, what the heck? That is All right, rough. I got to tell like, you guys. I'll, this I'll is... openly take the best, the team I said was the best team in the world and my favorite team, and I'll say why they're not making London. <laughs> <laughs> Let's just kick them out. Well, let me, we're going to test my salesmanship here. I've got Carmi yeah. Corp. Everyone Oxygen. clip this out of context and share and this it. Is, yeah, oh, I'm going to get fired. <laughs> 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 this is why Carmi Corp will not make the major. First and foremost, Everybody is still looking at them as the number one team. For some reason, even when they lose, everyone thinks they're still the best, including myself. And that's a lot of weight to carry. It's a lot of pressure on your shoulders. With that being said, there are two new teams that are genuine uh, contenders for regionals. And I think that's just going to make things just that much harder. I mentioned it earlier. Those top four are not so clear anymore. And listen, we're talking about LG, uh, Luna Galaxy and Oxygen, but that's not the only teams that I think have consolidated and done a little bit better job with their talent. We've got uh, Resolve. They're keeping Reziers. They've got Cash and Ivan. Now, I'm not thinking that is a regional winner, but maybe an upset here or there. Maybe grab a, a dub over KC in the Swiss stage to give them a tougher match as they roll into the bracket. But I think the big thing is that the consistency – it just can't last forever. We've seen it time and time again. BDS, NRG, now Vitality. It just can't last forever. And Carmi Corp has been incredible, but I think now is the time that they they tumble. Wow. <laughs> Impressive. Uh, the, the, they're, <laughs> All right, well, let me keep going with it. Let me keep going. Yeah, Oxygen. No. Now, we, Michael, I think you summed it up perfectly. They are that heavy hitter. They are full swinging. They're not going to be uh, cautious. They're not going to be careful. That's not what they're here to do. They're here to triple flip reset. They're here to pre-jump off the ceiling. What did we used to call it? The Tarzan swing. They're here <laughs> to clip and put on a show. They always have. I know that as someone that has casted. And unfortunately, we are prone to slow starts. We are prone to playing to the level of our competition. And we are prone to uh, some inconsistencies. Sometimes we just show up and have a bad day. And if you do that in Europe, then you're not going to make the major. Yen's just said it. You've got to be in the top four for at least two of these events, if not in the uh, top two for one of them, or you're not making it. And I, I've been talking about it in regard to the Francophone teams, but it's true for Oxygen as well. It's no longer just four teams that you have to jump. You And we're actually one point behind uh, Magnifico. So we got to jump that team as well. So I, I you know, I don't think Carmen Corp's making it. I don't think Oxygen's making it. Nice. Lando, you got that? So we got to make sure that gets out quick. <laughs> Everybody you know. <laughs> um, ship. Yeah, I, I, I can go next. Great picks. I totally agree, especially on the second one. Um, the ones I'm going to be doing are Luna Galaxy and uh, Gentlemates, the team I've been riding for the whole episode. That's great. Uh, Gentlemates, <laughs> it's really simple. Uh, you guys ever heard of the term lightning in a bottle? Yep. Because uh, that's what you saw down at Copenhagen. First of all, fraud win against G2, the best team in the world, obviously. Like, EU can only beat NA when they get lucky. Um, and then, you know, listen, they, they played really well. You can't take that away from them. But uh, at the end of the day, this is still the team that was top eight twice and was on the verge of not even making the major, if not for the other great teams in this region playing the teams that they were contending against. They looked pedestrian, okay? They looked very pedestrian. They looked like they were closer to the non-land teams than the other three big three French teams. Um and, you know, while you can't capture lightning in a bottle, greatness is consistency. And they have not proven to be consistently great. While the other teams have cores or players that have been consistently great for years upon years. You know, Seiko, love the guy. But half his career, he wasn't making, wasn't making majors, right? And, and not half, like a quarter of his career. Uh, you know, Tachi, uh, as Vatira, you know, he kicked him. And Vatira is the best player of all time. And Juicy, you know, he couldn't even win with Joyo, who's the best player in the world obviously, because he plays for Oxygen. So, you know, all three considered, uh, you know, they got lucky. They got a Mickey bracket. They only had to yeah. play every one and uh, every number one and two seed. I do that all the time in ranked. Um, and they're not going to make the major. Uh, <laughs> in terms of Luna Galaxy, uh, they have a Spanish player, and Spanish players throw. That's it. That's my whole thing. <laughs> Thank you. 
I mean, you're talking about getting lucky. The two teams that I have to somehow uh, get out of that top four uh, are Team Vitality and Team BDS, and they just got lucky last split. They, they <laughs> got to the finals of Europe before they actually met Carmen Corp in the bracket and got eliminated. You know, that's just pure luck. Uh, they're not they're not up for for another major. They're, they're not making it to London. Team Vitality and BDS. We've just been talking them then down. Can they regain? Hell no. Vitality. <laughs> they've got Rados in. Uh, I I said they shouldn't change that guy, but I'm, I'm I have to you know retract that statement. Um, it's it's time for a roster move, buddy. Uh, I can't keep up with Zen. Is it time uh, to learn the- APAC? Team BDS, I don't know why they even try to make to make it to the major because Drali is clearly not ready for it yet. Um, so honestly, just forfeit and go next. <laughs> See you in 2025. Before we move on, uh, that most of that was all sarcasm. Before you start, get to typing, okay? <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's not. We all believe everything that we just yeah. said wholeheartedly. <laughs> <laughs> Take it to the bank. Yeah. There we go. Clip it right. and ship it. Thank you. Uh, so that is the teams that we all don't think will make the major. Y'all give us uh, some votes in uh, the comments as well. Let us know who you think sold it best. Thank you all for watching ShiftCast. If you want to catch some more episodes, you can do so right here on this YouTube channel or on Spotify. We'll catch you next time.